Well, good morning and welcome back to Travels with Bart. This morning we have something a little bit different for you. We're going to go to hell. And I don't know if you can see, but in that very dark area behind me, that's the gates to hell. I should explain, shouldn't I? We're in a place called Wat Bikbekaram, which is in Nasan district of Surat Thani province, just over a, an hour away from home, about 70 or 80 kilometers. And actually the main temple is behind you, if you're facing me, it's over here. Not a terribly interesting place. But for some reason, they have built behind me what is supposed to be a depiction of hell. Oh, you have to excuse me if I keep slapping myself because I'm getting eaten alive by mosquitoes here. And so we'll go and take a look, but I have to warn you, viewer discretion is advised because it's the most bizarre place I have ever been to, and you might find it quite upsetting or distressing, but it's a place that's publi publicly accessible, it's open to everyone, so I don't see why we shouldn't go and take a look. So rather than sitting here getting eaten by mosquitoes, we'll go over through that dark entrance there and get eaten by mosquitoes down there. And I have to say, I'm probably not gonna say very much because I don't really understand the place, except it's supposed to look like hell. And if you ever end up there, well, you'll know what to expect. Okay, so let's go. So I'm sure Bert is very happy not to be taken through the gates of hell. We'll leave him there while we wander down here. I must admit that I didn't know quite where this place was. This morning I came into the temple area and I couldn't find the gates to hell. But I chatted with a couple of friendly monks and they made me realize that it wasn't actually in the temple. We have to go across the road here. I suppose that's a good idea not to have hell inside a temple. So we have to talk very nicely to these two guys and hope that they will allow us to enter hell. The first thing we see is this bunch of people here who seem to be being lectured about something. One can guess that they're being told that if they misbehave, then they're going to end up going down there somewhere and ending up in hell. So, the big guy is pointing to his left, so that's our right, so we'll wander down here and see what we can find. And the first thing we find, I think, really defies all kind of explanation. No reason why I can't wander in amongst these. Sure, why I'd want to. It's like something from another planet. I'm actually looking at the video on my iPad. I can tell you it looks on a lot brighter on the iPad than it does in real life. It's actually very damp and very spooky and very mosquito y. And what on earth do we have here? Something else that defies description. Naked people up a prickly tree being poked with pointed sticks. Yes, yeah, very pleasant. Well, this looks like fun, doesn't it? Let's just throw a few people into a, a vat of boiling oil. Seems like a fun thing to do for today. Yeah, there's the old logs burning away down there. Okay, chuck the next one in.
No, no, you're not escaping. Get down in there. Yup, oh, another one coming in here. Make room, another one coming in. Well, I'll keep wandering down here, but I must admit, I don't know how many more of these statues there are. I don't know how many more of these statues you want to see. But anyway, oh yes, I think I can see some more here. Don't go away. Okay, what do we have here? Well, I really have no idea. But whatever it was they did, I'm sure they're wishing they hadn't. Oh, someone's left them a bottle of water. I'm sure they'll appreciate that. Must be thirsty work, this. Oh, now we have someone on the left side. No, I really don't know. No good asking me. probably said something they shouldn't have done. Oh yeah, this one definitely did. Oh no, you shouldn't say things like that. Ah. Oh, here's another one. Uh, did he say the same thing or something completely different? We just don't know. And just when you think we might have finished, we definitely haven't. Oh, get rid of that nasty hair. It's seriously gruesome, isn't it? And somebody left the candle there because? Not a clue. Not a clue. And that's still not the end of it because there's still more down here. Is this the same boiling in oil as before? No, I don't think so. Well, the mind boggles. Well, mine does, anyways. Okay, you're next. In you go. Splish. I have to admit, I have no idea how to get out of hell. I just keep going around in circles, I guess, until I find the exit. And I do believe this is the way out. We can actually leave hell. And when I said viewer discretion is advised, I wasn't joking, was I? But anyways, it's something completely different. All right, that's it. Now you know what hell looks like. Uh, next week we'll try to find somewhere a little bit nicer for you. But for now, it's goodbye from Bert and it's goodbye from me. Goodbye.